guys, welcome back to the channel. Pooja is with us today, surprisingly, at the track. Uh, something you guys don't know about me, I race uh, for a team called Team Prudent Motorsports and I also drive a coach for them. Uh, today I'm not racing, but I am here to help uh, the race engineering course that they have. Uh, I'm going to be driving a race prepped S team with a bunch of engineers that are going to be helping uh, set up the car and develop it to get faster and better. Prudent Motorsports takes part in a lot of different championships. We drive in the MRF championship here in India as well as the JK tyre. We drive the Formula LGB F4. I drive the car as well. And uh, apart from that, we take part in the Dubai Endurance Championship, which is one of the most prestigious four-stroke karting championships in the world. Uh, we take part in that four rounds of racing in Dubai. Uh, we have a six hour, a 12 hour, 700 kilometers and a 24 hour endurance race and I'm the captain for the team for the championship. I'm going to take you to the track, uh, take you on the track and um, show you guys what we're going to do today. I'll show you some good onboard footage as well and hope you guys enjoy. Uh, I'm, I'm sure you all have been working with Gagan, so you all know how to take driver feedback and how to put it into the car, right? How to develop the car. So that's the most important part of it. I mean, us as drivers is only one aspect of racing. The main thing is you guys preparing a car or preparing a go kart or whatever for us. Okay, guys, we're right now sitting in the race prepped S team by Prudent More Sports, prepared by Gagan and Ayush. And let me show you what it's like inside. We're currently refueling the car. That's the rest of the pit crew there. Um, this is what it looks like inside. It's completely gutted. There's absolutely nothing, no dash, no door panels, none of that. But we do have safety features like the roll cage all around and the fire extinguisher, a fuel cutoff, ECU cutoff, ignition cutoff. Uh, we do have this button here, which is a fan so that we can keep the fan running all the time instead of it just coming on whenever the engine overheats so this is something that we do manually to keep the engine cool and uh, that's what the interior looks like we're gonna get one screen up here which is right now connected to one of the the laptops but that's the micron the micron gives us all our data from our revs to our temperatures to the graph of uh, our performance graphs our braking graphs all of that and then what we do with that is uh, we connect it to the computer and then we can start accessing this data and we can start analyzing it and see where we can do better as well as me as a driver i can see where i can do better because i can i can compare my laps and see what i'm doing in different laps or different sessions and um, i can try to break later or maybe turn in a little different into a corner apex it a little different things like that i'll show you very interesting stuff i'll show you this by the way is the ecu this is standalone race dynamics ecu this controls the car and that as well can be connected to a computer to try and uh, change things about with, in regard with the regard to the performance Yesterday? Uh, yesterday we ran uh, because it was hot, so we went for 27 in the front and 25 in the back. So yeah. And today? So today we are going for 26. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, so these are the guys that are gonna get all the data now and start analyzing it. You've got all the data from the Micron? Yes, sir. Okay, cool. <laughs> Clown of the track. Naveen. Yeah, we are collecting all the GPS data, like longitudinal acceleration, lateral acceleration, so that we could see whether he is oversteering or understeering, so that that would help us, help us give the driver a feedback so that he would do uh, something different so that he could gain more time. Okay. And uh, what's my fastest time today in the first session? 13.002. Okay, so 13 flat. Yeah. 13 flat. Awesome. What was the fastest time yesterday? 13.983 was the fastest time. 13.98. 13.983. So we already beat yesterday's time. Yeah. So what do you think? Scary. Scary? Yeah. Uh, just got done with the first session. I think I could, I could do a lot better. Uh, lots to develop on the car. Lots of things to do to make the car handle a little better. Uh, and also me, because I've not driven in really long. So these are the hands-on guys for today in the pit. And the guys behind the computer, so they keep switching out. Uh, they keep taking turns. Sometimes uh, the guys on the computers are here. And then we switch them out so that they have enough experience and they know what's going on. on uh, in, in all aspects of uh, being an engineer.
Okay, so we had to cut short this session because of the rain uh, and we're running slick tires on the car. Slick tires are the ones without grooves, for those who don't know. Uh, they're good to increase traction because it increases the surface area, but in the dry, not in the wet. But in the meantime, uh, I've got with me the guy who, one of the guys who's helped build this car. I'm driving a 1300 Suzuki S-Team today, uh, specially race built for Prudent Motorsports by Gagan. Hi, hello to all of you at Sandu Stories. And uh, yeah, so we started this uh, build up about uh, two years ago in 2019. Uh, the idea was to take the car to national racing championships. And uh, of course, uh, the mentor is the person behind the camera, uh, who was the core guiding uh, person behind the whole thing. And as it came along, uh, we have been testing and developing the car for the past two years, two and a half years now. Uh, we were able to compete at a uh, few national racing events. Uh, we did score a uh, uh, top 10 position in the uh, 2019 championship, and then we managed to have a, a fifth, uh, a decent sixth finish. Actually, not fifth, a sixth, uh, decent sixth finish at uh, the first endurance that ever took place in India. It was KMS 50, and uh, beyond that, uh, we have a huge engineering crew with us, uh, who we have been uh, training and developing the vehicle all together with. Uh, Today we are at uh, one of our testing tracks uh, which we chose to uh, develop the small section or the, basically the dynamic part of the car and uh, as we do it uh, we have our uh, specialized driver Mr. Suhail Sabarwal also with us giving us the feedbacks to uh, enjoy the right amount of development in the right direction of course. With that in mind and of course the motorsports as always it is quite fun. Uh, with added rain yes a little bit uh, off the point today but uh, still yeah we are going good. You guys may know him from some of the Telugu movies. <laughs> so Varma, Abhishek Varma, come here bro. Welcome to my vlog finally. All the Sad other boys, reveal. all the other boys have yeah, been on so it. Uh, late but uh, better, better late than never I guess. Yeah, so Varma has also uh, been racing, been racing before me actually. And he's also here with Prudent Motorsports and he handles everything to do with the carts, with the two-stroke carts, the go, uh, uh, Rotax go-carts that we've got here. And Varma is today on day four. We're on day four. Day four yeah. of level one training yeah. his students. Uh, so it's a packed house here in the pitch. You can see all the different teams. We've got the bikers. We've got a uh, few other cars that are parked there that are go waiting to go on track. We've got all the go-karts from different teams all across India. And uh, Varma has also been in uh, karting a long time. He's done, I think, the first Rotax race as well yeah, that uh, happened yeah, in India. That happened like around, like I think, 15, 17 years back. But I guess now we uh, almost too, too like, old for this <laughs> <laughs> so, but time why I said you guys have met all the other boys and not Varma yet because Varma is also part of uh, the entire gang that you keep seeing where we travel to and stuff but he's just always busy shooting so he hasn't come on any of our trips Alright guys, that was our long and tiring day here at the track at uh, Miko Kartopia, Bangalore We did a couple of sessions in the race team uh, super tiring, I definitely lost a couple of kgs, I don't know how many but I'm gonna go home and check but at least two kgs for sure. Uh, you guys saw what we did on the track. I uh, introduced you to Abhishek Varma. So he handles level one and level two training. All, all that has to do with karting. I helped the team out with uh, the race engineering, what we were doing today, as well as uh, the Dubai uh, endurance car uh, karting, Singapore, Malaysia, and uh, the Formula LGB cars as well. If you guys have any questions, of course, y'all can ask me in the comments and I'll answer them. So do let me know and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Oh, 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 oh,